Welcome back. Former politician, chairman of Sunshine Holdings Limited and board member of Focal Holdings Limited, the late Radley Roberts, was honored posthumously as Focal Holdings named its latest and largest tanker, the Brad Sun, in his honor. Governor General, Her Excellency, the Most Honorable Dame Marguerite Pindling, and Robert's widow were present to mark the occasion. Focal Chairman Sir Franklin Wilson says the latest ship brings the fleet to six. This one is significant because, as Mr. Robinson said, it's our largest. It's an ocean-going ship, which means that wherever we can go to get the best product on the best terms, if it's the Gulf, Venice Bay, Trinidad, wherever it is, this tanker, we can send it. But at the same time, it can navigate the shallow waters of the Bahamas and the Turks and Caicos. That, ladies and gentlemen, is a significant combination of features. Wilson says the vessel has 10 times the capacity of legacy fuel tankers in the Bahamas. The focal chairman explained the name of the vessel and remarked on the accomplishment of the Sunshine Boys. The Brad refers to the late Bradley B. E. Roberts. The Sun relates to the legacy of a group commonly referred to as the Sunshine Boys. Bradley was both a founding member and became the first chairman of Sunshine Holdings Limited, which has become the legacy company of the Sunshine Boys. This group came into existence before the political independence of the Commonwealth of the Bahamas. Its initial mission was to prove that persons of humble origins could cooperate to own and manage large businesses. 